What up, y'all? Welcome back to Ruckus TV. Today, we're unboxing the Nitrous Express 3 bolt plate Nitrous System for the LS1 that'll be going into the Ruckus Drift Car. Let's get into it. All right, y'all, so this system it is a full kind of plug and play, I guess, system. Got the two solenoids here, one's for the fuel and one's for the nitrous. I forget which one's which, but then you've got the color coding here, the wide open throttle switch right there. So it all comes in a big package, right? Three bolt, that's the, I want to say 78 millimeter or 87, whatever the stock one is anyway. Uh, it might even say on here. Made in the USA though. And then you've got your three lines there. And then your fittings come in here. These are your nozzles, right? Uh, your jets and yeah, 78 millimeter for the throttle body. And then you've got, uh, what is it? Well, I think you've got from anywhere from 50 to 350 horsepower. This says 200. 250, 300, and 350. But I believe you also have for the smaller ones. And here's some extra line. And then you've got the two bottle brackets. Now I, I actually got a bottle bracket from Nitrous Express. So that's what I'm running. Uh, it does only hold one. They do have a dual bottle bracket. As you notice, I got two of the big ones, right? So, uh, two 15 pound bottles. Anyway, then you've got all your little wiring fittings that you need, your relay here, and then you've got your, your switch right there. And I don't know what that is. I'm guessing it's some kind of uh, like electrical glue or something. So anyway, that's that. Now, Nitrous Express was also kind enough to send me this, which is a bottle warmer purge setup and it's also got the down the blow off so in this box there's the bottle heater so that'll go wrap around the bottle while it sits on there okay uh, just kind of go through this here you got your blow off your down blow off there, more electrical connection, some wiring, another relay, your gauge, which is liquid filled there. Uh, this is the pressure switch. You've got your two connectors, which I actually might use Do the Deutsch connectors, because these are the cheapy ones. Don't really like those. Uh, this is for the purge. There's the purge setup, okay. And then you've got your other little fittings, right? Two of those. And I've got, these are dash six. We've got another switch here. And then I think this is the solenoid for the purge as well, or something like that. So anyway, so you've got all that, okay. I also bought two gauges, so you'll see these gauges there. Uh, these are not liquid filled that I know of, but they don't move. So, and they're adjustable, I believe from 900 to 1200 PSI. So, which obviously you've got your green range in there is 900 to 1200. And I believe you wanna be running about 950 or something. So I got two 15 pound bottles equipped with this Lightning 500 valve. And then you've got your port out here. And then you've got the gauge port that goes out here. So we'll put those gauges on there. And then another gauge port there. So depending on where you put the bottle. Now I've also got this. This is a surge tank. 
they don't even make this anymore. I got this before the pandemic and uh, I never got to do the install. And then obviously the pandemic happened, so then everything got pushed back. But anyway, it comes with two pumps. It holds, I, I wanna say it's like one and a half or maybe like a gallon or something like that. I think it's, a, I think it's one gallon. Got your two pumps there. Ugh. This up there. Got your two pumps there. You got your return. Then you've got your positives and negatives here for each pump. Your fill here, so that just comes undone. And then you've got all your little screws here. So you got four, seven. It's like 13, 13 screws around the outside. All right. So the three bolt kit that I bought. Sorry, that I got. Uh, it was a sponsorship deal, so thank you, Nitrous Express, big ups. Anyway, the, the kit that I got came with one bottle. I did have to purchase another bottle. I bought it at a discount, so. And then we got the, the two packages here that came with it. That's one unit. Now, the other unit is this right here. So this is the second. This, this box is the second unit, bottle warmer, purge kit, blow off uh, pipe or whatever. All right. Then the third item is the, the surge tank. And then I got these separate, but I, I did buy these. Um, I think they may, have, they may have given me these as well. So anyway, they gave me most of this. The only thing I had to purchase was this. All right, so the bottles are aluminum. As I said, these are 15 pound bottles. You can get it in a 10 pound bottle setup as well. And it's a little bit cheaper. I think it's uh, like $150 cheaper. Inside the accessory pack, you've got, we're just gonna read it off here. Uh, fully automatic bottle heater and pressure transducer. Carburetor fuel pressure safety switch. Okay, liquid filled nitrous gauge, pressure gauge. NHRA approved pressure release fitting, NHRA approved blowdown tube, and then all the electrical connections you need, and then the purge valve uh, on the X2 systems only, I guess. But we do have the purge system on, our, on this setup. Since it does come as part of it, so that's like I said, that's this piece here. Well, here's the two, okay, and then you've got your, your uh, purge solenoid right here, and then this will be your fittings for that. And then I don't think this is, I don't think that's for the, I think it's this one, one of these will be the fitting for the purge. Now, as far as our setup, uh, they do have the wide open throttle switch, but we're gonna be using the Holly Terminator setup, and I'm gonna try and ramp it in instead of having it just all at once. I want it to be kind of a progressive shot, if you will, and I know that Nitrous Express sells a kit that you can buy. It's the Maximizer 5 or something like that. So I know you can buy something that will allow you to kind of mess around with that. But as far as I'm seeing, Holly, this, the software allows you to ramp it in as if it's like the Maximizer setup. So I, yeah, I guess that's the beauty of having control of your motor. You get to control the engine. Uh, or sorry, the, the like the timing, the, the gas input, the the uh, nitrous input, and all that stuff. So I, I'm looking forward to it. It'll be my first time messing with nitrous as well. So hopefully everything will work out, and there won't be a manifold explosion in the uh, passenger passenger compartment. So anyway, that's it for today. Thanks for tuning in. Till the next time, be the ruckus, bring the ruckus. And I'm out.